You know, I, I've been an orphan since I was a year old. I was born in Boston, and I was brought up an Irish space fighter. And I always told him when I was 16, I was going to beat, but I was just going to whip him, that's all. When I was 16, I couldn't quite do it, so I left him. I went to work on the waterfront. And I always said I wanted to do something worthwhile with my life. And I wanted to become a sculptor. And then one day when I was 13, I'd read about this man, Borgum, climbing a mountain. A little thinking that about 16 years later, I was going to be working as his assistant on Mount Rushmore. Then I got a letter from this old Indian I'd never met, Standing Bear. And he asked if I'd build a memorial to their people so the white people know the red man had great heroes also. Well, having brought myself up, and being American of Polish descent, I thought that was a, well, wasn't too much to ask for. And I had no place to go. So I decided that I'd keep my life doing this. and a steel, and I drilled my holes around three, four feet deep and blow them off. Then I bought an old compressor, it was 24 years old, no Buddha, weighed around four tons. And I put a pipeline 2,440 feet long from the compressor on the ground up to the top of the mountain. And I bought a jackhammer. Now this took two years to get all this done. And then I bought another hammer and then my steel. Dynamite is rather expensive, and my electric cap. So for the first seven years, I climbed that 741 steps, and I carried everything up on my back. When I go up, I'd start the big compressor. I used to crank it, you know, and I'd put a 50-pound box of dynamite in one shoulder, and put a wire, a string of bits around my neck. Then I'd take maybe an 8 or 10 or 12, 14-foot steel in my left hand, and that's how I'd start up the mountain. The old Buddha, the old compressor, was kind of decrepit, and I'd get sometimes part of the way up, and I'd just hear that thing go kaput, 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 kaput. <laughs> Put everything down, walk all the way down the staircase, start it up again, crank it up, wait there five minutes, start up the mountain, pick everything up, go up to the top, which is quite a distance, put all my things down, Get my air valve cleaned out, oil the hammer, pick it up, get my starter seal in it. Just start to drill one hole, get down about a foot, and you could hear the big Buddha, kaput, the kaput, the kaput. Down I'd go again. One day I did that nine times. You know, that gets awful old. Oh, I tell you, that walk up and down there was terrible. My lands are where my dead lie buried. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? 